Assalamualaikum and hello. In this video, I'm going to show you how to solve simultaneous equation by using scientific calculator. And I'm going to use Casio FX570 in this video. Now, if you're looking for other type of calculator, maybe you can check uh, the link in my description below. So what I have here, I have three equations, which is I2 plus I3 is equals to I1. The second equation is 30 is equal to 40 I1 plus 10 I2. And the third equation is 10 is equal to 40 I3 minus 10 I2. So what we have here, we have three unknowns and we want to find the unknowns. I1, I2 and I3. Now before we use the calculator, we need to rearrange the equations in the general form of ax plus by plus cz is equals to d. So our first equation will become uh, i1 minus i2 minus i3 is equals to 0. So the unknowns is actually x y and z so in this case i1 is x i2 is y and i3 is z the second equation is 40 i1 plus 10 i2 we don't have i3 in this equation so that is plus 0 i3 is equals to 30 and the last equation we don't have i1 in this equation so that is 0 i1 uh, minus 10 i2 plus 40 i3 is equals to 10. So now let's use the calculator. So we press mode three times, choose number one for equations. Since we have three unknowns, we press three and the calculator will prompt us to key in the value for A1. So the value for A1 for the first equation is just 1i1 negative 1 negative 1 and d1 is 0 for the second equation is 40 10 0 and 30 and the third equation a3 is 0 negative 10 positive 40 and 10 so now we have the value for i1 i2 and i3 uh, given in the calculator so i1 is equals to 0 0.6667 now this equation we want to find the value of current so the, the, the unit for current is ampere for the second one I2 is equals to 0 0.3333 ampere and the third one is I3 which is equals to 0 0.3333 3 ampere so that's all for this video i hope you learned something from this video don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more videos thank you for watching